This section of the DVD will talk about the practical and emotional support Chaz offers families at the end of their child's life. The hospice is an area that is reserved for families whose child has recently died, allowing them to remain with their child up until their funeral. This incorporates the Rainbow Room, where you and your family can spend time to say goodbye to your child and to reflect in privacy. Chaz recognises that the loss of a child requires special bereavement support, often over a long period of time. Chaz offers ongoing contact and various resources after the death of a child or young person for as long as it's needed. This takes many forms and can include telephone support from befrienders and the care team, as well as home visits. It also includes the ongoing support of the Forget Me Not group at Rachel House, which provides an opportunity to spend time with other parents who have experienced the loss of a child and to share memories. We have been coming to Rachel House now for just over four years for four and a half years. In the first instance, the staff were helpful in just showing us the whole setup. We got introduced to being um, how things worked with the rainbow room, with the rooms that you could use, with the family rooms that are upstairs that you can stay in when you come and do your visit. Uh, after Stevie died, we had, well, I made use of the one-on-one -on -one bereavement counselling service. The two girls that worked with us while we were here with Stevie, they kept in touch as well. Um, which was always very nice, sending cards and things and just showing that they remembered, which was lovely. The Forget Me Not service has been, has been great in keeping the memory alive and going and making it much more of a three-dimensional thing. Everything here is obviously very tangible and they do little remembering activities and we get to talk about his name and he's got his photo on the wall along there and it makes it a very positive thing for them to remember him and it's not a, a sad and sort of morbid thing. The hospice also has a regular newsletter to keep parents in touch with meetings and hospice news. There are options available to participate in more focus groups, such as Seasons for Growth. And last but not least, Chaz also hosts Remembering Days, offering an opportunity for families to visit the hospice and participate in a service of remembrance. The important thing to remember is that Chaz will fit around your needs at this time, and that's for as long as it's needed. If after watching this section you have questions you'd like to ask someone about the bereavement support offered by Chaz at the hospice, you can find the contact information at the end of the DVD.